The second one is cracks. And a crack is what you think of a crack for in anything. It's uh, where two parts of it have uh, broken apart, sheared apart, and you have now a void running through a certain section of it. And you can see that here in this picture. You have a nice uh, little crack running right through the middle of it. Now there are a couple ways that you can get cracks in die casting. One is if it's caused thermally, if you have temper temperature variations across the casting, you're going to have internal stresses and those internal stresses could end up pulling the casting in certain ways and causing a crack. The other way you can get a crack is mechanically. So if there is improper ejection, so if you have uh, die pins, if you have ejector pins that are too short, or if you have ejector pins that are stuck and not pushing out, or if you have the casting that's stuck in one section and it only one half of the casting is getting pushed out, it's going to end up bending the casting and could cause cracking. The other way to cause a crack is to mishandle it. If you drop it, bang it against something, you can cause a crack that way. To purchase access to this course, visit the NADCA Marketplace at www.diecasting.org store. Purchasing a course through the online education system grants you one year of access to the recording, presentation, support material, and test when applicable. NADCA Video News and Information is brought to you by the following sponsors.